Hi, in this tutorial I continue with another tool and with this one we can draw freehand lines, keyboard shortcut F6. We have two different modes and these modes are the same as the modes in the Bezier tool which we already discussed. And the first one, with this one we can create regular Bezier path and if we click drag and then release the mouse we create a path and you see that this one is a complex path. And if I select the Edit Path by Notes tool, you see we have many notes here. And the reason for that is because this smoothing option is on a low number. And if I increase that, I will simplify the path. If I start creating now and release, you'll see that the path is now smooth and simple. And if I select the Edit Path by Notes tool, you see that we have very little notes. Now let's delete this and continue with the create spiral path. Now you see here that with low setting of the smoothing the spiral path doesn't work very well. So we need to increase that and you see how this works but if you go too far you also start getting results like this. A straight line even though I made a curve this is because the smoothing is too high let's delete all these and with this option you can uh, reset the settings now the next one here shape is the same again as the Bezier tool with triangle in you see we start with a thick path and it becomes thinner with triangle out it starts with a thinner path becomes thicker with ellipse both ends are thinner and it's thicker in the middle and the last mode uh, shape is uh, from clipboard I already showed that we can create a shape let's say something like this control C to copy it and then go back here and you see we draw with this shape now. Now another thing I want to show you is that you can append to selected path using the shift key. Again just like the Bezier tool. Let's try one more time. We can append to the selected path. Another thing that you can do is hold down the alt key and enter sketch mode and you see that holding the alt key interpolates between sketch path and just click drag I'm holding down the alt key and if I release here you see the average path I also release the alt key to apply the effect so that's it for this tool and this tutorial I hope you liked it if it helped subscribe like the video and one more thing, I'm starting to make Blender tutorials on my other channel that I make game tutorials. So link will be in the description if you want to visit the channel and watch tutorials on GIMP and Blender. And that's it for now. Bye.